And now, the pièce de résistance. <laughs> oh my gosh, more food. I mean, how is that even possible? Don't worry, we're gonna jog it off tomorrow. You guys know my motto. There's, There's always room, room for, for dessert. dessert. Yes. Yeah, not after five courses, no. Okay, fine. I'm gonna put it in the kitchen in case anybody changes their mind. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Just out of curiosity, what, what is for dessert? Oh, this is my signature recipe. Pumpkin Ugh. cheesecake with a graham cracker crust. It's killing me. Is that maple whipped cream? Yes. All right, put that down. I'm gonna grab a slice. <laughs> I can't not. This has been the best Christmas with you guys. I want to do this every Christmas Eve. Let's make Christmas Eve dinner our tradition. Okay, and I think I speak for our family when I say we are in. Yes. <laughs> oh, we're in. So you cut it while I get some It's plates. so pretty. I don't want to cut it, but I'm going to. Okay, you okay. guys, come on. Get in position. Yay. Get in front of the tree. I don't want to stand next to her. Why don't you go outside? Sky, be nice. Look at the supermodel, dork. Jay. Sky! Oh my gosh, someday you guys are gonna get along, I swear. Never. Oh, would you look at that? We were finally agreeing on something. Honey, come on. Come on, you guys, get in front of the tree. Okay. Get in tight, everybody. Come on, nice. And everyone, say pumpkin cheesecake. Pumpkin. <laughs>
Okay, well, you know what? To be fair, I do have meat. <laughs> Are you in town for the holidays? Kind of a working holiday. I'm, I'm renting a house down the block. Oh, the Morgan place. You must be the writer. I guess everybody here does know everybody. Oh, you have no idea. <laughs> so welcome to the other North Pole, the one without polar bears and elves. But you do have reindeer. Usually, they pass through here every year, except for last year, and it doesn't look like we'll see them this year either. Oh, no. The Wildlife Bureau was supposed to send someone out, so. Hey, is there something fun going on over here without me? Trish, <laughs> this is uh... Kendall Curry. Hi. <laughs> Trish Rivera, self-proclaimed queen of the North Pole, mother of all cheesecakes, and breaker of game night records. <laughs> I'm Diana Forrester. You're Trish and Diana. Uh, You've heard of us? us? Literally everyone I have met in North Pole seems to talk about you two. The unstoppable duo who wins the home decorating contest every Christmas. Oh, okay. well, that's Trish. That's all Trish. I just helped that, her out. That is so not true. <laughs> Diana is the yin to my yang. Hey, would you mind if I take a photo of you two for American Life? The website? That's the one. <gasps> We love American life. Yes, so. we do. It is about time you did a story in our little town. Well, that's the perfect place to start. OK. OK. Smile. <laughs> now that's a friendship. See? Oh, oh you look great. great. You both look great. Oh, oh. duty calls. It's nice meeting you, too. Yeah, I'm sure we'll see you again. Merry Christmas. You see that purse? Yeah. Fake Fendi. How can you tell? Because I have a real one. Uh, Tin Soldier! Uh, um. Uh, Nutcracker! Uh, I. Pear Tree! Yes! <laughs> that is another win! That is a three P for the Rivera's! And this would not be a party without Diana's fabulous Da Vinci cookies, a true culinary art people. And you know my motto, there's always room for yes! Yes! All right, one lone cookie left. Mm. Painted in 1503. Mm. In oil, not canola. <laughs> Paid attention in art history. Thank you for recommending the course. It was really interesting. Hey, it was Jake. He is job hunting. Yeah, we thought that a diploma from his Ivy League school would guarantee him a job right away, but that is why Sky is going to grad school. You'll thank me later. I'm sorry, I gotta take this. It's a, a work thing. You helping mom out with best holiday house again? Uh, yes, she is. And we're going to win another golden reindeer. She does love winning. It's not the worst quality to have. It is if you text pear tree to your charades partner. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> OK, all right. She does bend the rules sometimes, but it's harmless. You know, and then she will host a dozen fundraisers to make up for that. You're such a good friend. You always defend her. Yeah, I guess I do. So when do we get to meet this new boyfriend? Oh, no, we don't. That's over and done. I'm single and so not ready to mingle. I hear that. At least we've got each other this Christmas. Mm -hmm. Give me a hug. Mm, thank you. <laughs> mm, thank you. Honey, will you please take this over to Jake, please? Do I have to? Yes, you have to. It's Christmas. Go, walk it over, please. Thank you. I know, right? Yes. Can you please? Yeah. Thank you. Keep going. I'm going to give you a generous Keep going. Pouring. Don't Let's stop, just, please. Just Thank you. Show that Delicious. Merry Christmas. Oh, 
on Christmas Day. Ho, ho, ho! <laughs> that just came on. Uh-huh. What, you, you never seen a four-pack before? Looks more like a two. <laughs> Leftovers, thanks. I'm not stealing you away from frat boy. We're not together anymore. Oh, Sky Rivera without a boyfriend on Christmas. That's a first. For you too, huh? First Christmas without your dad here? Yeah, well, he wasn't all that here even when he was around. And now he's with his new wife, so that'd be a little awkward. So he broke up with you, or? I think I did it. Good. Good? I, I just mean good. I'm glad you did it. So that you're not heartbroken. Wouldn't want to ruin your Christmas. Hmm. Surprised you care. Mm, I don't, really. But with us knowing each other for so long, you know. Yep. Long time. Yeah, long time. Anyway, um, I'd better get back. See you around. Yeah, see ya. I like your hair. Brunette's a good look on you. Wait. Was that a compliment from Jake Forrester? No, it's, it's just an observation. Thanks for the observation. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. All the reindeer. I thought there were supposed to be reindeer. Well, not anymore, I guess, but it's still full of holiday spirit around here. There's this house decorating contest on Christmas Eve. The entire town goes bananas for it. And there are these two women, Trish and Diana, they're best friends, and they team up every year and win. They're like local legends. They're perfect for American life. Okay, okay, I'm gonna stop you right there. We are no longer interested in American life. But it, it's literally the name of the website. Well, that may be, but we have a new mandate. Since when? Ever since my father retired. But he told me nothing was gonna change. I'm afraid it has to. Daddy nearly drove this company into the ground. He wouldn't listen to me when I told him that nobody wants to read about small town fireplace hot cocoa crap anymore. That crap got us through some tough times when I was a kid. Oh, I'm so sorry your childhood was so hard for you but I'm running a business. I need something new, something edgier. Everybody wants a feel-good story once in a while. Feel good doesn't pay the bills. Look, my father liked you. I like you, but if you want to stick around here, you've got to help me out. I need clickbait. Clickbait? The site needs traffic, Kendall. Beep, beep. Get to work. We 
almost bought a Montmartre oh. in Prague. It was breathtaking and a true dichotomy of past work. Oh, the way he captured the the subversive hermeneutics of design. I'm so sorry. Could you two excuse me for just one minute? I just I... hi. Hello. Please pretend you know me. What? I'm trying to escape Mr. and Mr. Pretentious, three o'clock. Isn't this your gallery? Yes. How do you know they're not buyers? They're not. You can tell that just by looking at something? Because they come in every holiday for the free wine and appetizers. Huh. Mm. Merry Christmas. So, am I a buyer? Huh. Um, you are thinking about you're traveling, you don't ever really stay in one place for very long. Also, you're just not ready to commit to a reindeer. <laughs> it's close, except I am willing to commit to a reindeer. National Wildlife Bureau, I've been waiting for you. Nick Ames, specializing in the conservation of caribou. What did you say? Reindeer. Diana Forrester, painter of reindeer and Terrible salesperson. Nice to meet you, Nick Ames. Nice to meet you, Diana Forrester. <laughs> See you around. Yeah. Who's that? That's the reindeer guy. Who? Nobody. Because it's Christmas time. And the ground is white Let's gather round and sing a song By the fire Well, is he cute? I don't know, I don't know. I mean, he's just here for the reindeer, so, you know, I... <sighs> so, he is cute. Diana, you cannot just wallow in this divorce. You have to get back out there. I so don't want to get back out there. Okay, well, if you don't want to do it for yourself, then do it for Jake. For Jake? Yes. As soon as you move on with your life, he's going to move on with his life, too. He's job hunting. Sweetie, he's floundering. You cannot let him just do whatever he wants. You're enabling him. What? I just feel like you're always pushing me. Well, that's our thing. Well, maybe this year I'm a little more sensitive. Okay, but if I don't push you, who will? Besides, Bob's already remarried. You can't just let him win. It's not always about winning. What is that supposed to mean? I don't know, like cheating on family game night and then making your daughter lie about it. She told you that? Did you really cheat at charades? You were cheating, Mrs. Rivera? Hi, girls. <laughs> Look at those great outfits! Got any cookies? Door deliveries are over. Was a three-peat really fake? No, Maddie. Your parents lost fair and square, okay? It's Madeline now. Oh, well, sign me up for five boxes of Thin Mints, okay? Sorry, you'll have to wait until cookie season like everyone else. Oh my god, oh my god. The entire town's gonna know by dinner time! That trip was a propaganda machine! They destroyed Brie Flanagan! Well, Brie Flanagan was arrested for shoplifting. And who turned her in? Trope 9! How could you do that to me? I didn't see them! You didn't see five Girl Scouts popping out of Christmas trees? No, I go tell them you were joking. No. That's what you always want me to do. I always defend you. What is wrong with you today? Well, apparently everything. My husband left me. I'm not ready to move on. I'm a bad parent. I never said you were a bad parent, okay? I'm being a friend, and friends tell each other things that they don't always want to hear. Okay, well, in the spirit of friendship, you should know that Sky thinks that you smother her. Ugh! Smother? I mean, my God, Trish, let her live her life for five minutes without you planning everything about it. Oh, really? Well, you want to know why Jake's really back home? Because you want him there so you don't have to be alone. 
when the kids were freshmen and you were in Turks and Caicos. Sky asked me to adopt her. Why would my daughter want to trade down? I don't know. But maybe I did see those Girl Scouts. Oh my God! Oh! You want to see a show, everybody? Trish's signature pumpkin cheesecake recipe is Bobby Flay's! Oh my god, did you hear about Trish Rivera? She got caught cheating at Christmas charades. Who does that? Are you kidding me? Look, Trish tells everyone she's 44. Honey, I know for a fact she is 49. Now this is what I'm talking about. You can just see the hostility in Diana's paintings. Look at those antlers. You know, Trish and Diana's houses are right across the street from each other, which means one of them might be on the market soon. I hope it's Trish. Bigger commish. So what did she throw? I didn't serve it, but my sources tell me it was an iced holiday latte with double whipped cream. Messy. Uh, did something happen? Oh, Trish and Diana split up. Officially, not like that fake fight they had in 09. That's awful. Seriously, what will we do for entertainment now? I thought you said these two were supposed to be best friends. Well, one of them, Trish. Apparently she cheated on game night. And then Diana called her out on it, so Trish threw a frappuccino in her face. Really? I know you said you wanted something edgy. Yeah, go on, go on, go on. So I'm thinking, it's this cozy Christmas town, perfect on the outside, but with a kind of... Dark underbelly. Well, it's not quite that bad. I can see it. Backstabbing modern mothers living in first world anarchy. Anarchy? These women will stop at nothing to destroy each other's reputations. We'll call it the Real Housewives of the North Pole. Are you sure this is what we should be doing? This is exactly what we should be doing. Stay on it, get a story. And Kendall, the nastier the better. Uh, please help me. How do I get these pictures of Diana off of here? And I'm gonna need a new iPad because I'm gonna smash this one. What's going on? What's going on? She betrayed me. She betrayed our entire family, okay? So effective immediately, all contact with the foresters is forbidden. Oh. Mom? Hey. Everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Oh, BTW, we're no longer in speaking terms with the Riveras. Wait, what? Trish is a facade, just like her house. Their house is a palace. Well, the bank owns it. They're living off of fumes, and she is going to regret that she shared all her secrets with me. What happened? It's best you don't know the deeds. You and Sky were never close, so it shouldn't really affect you anyway. Trish has been your best friend since we moved here. People change, right? People that you've known for years, people that you've made memories with, people that you've been married to. Are you sure this is about Trish? It's dead, but I, I'll, I'll call him back. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay, take it. You know what, actually? Invite him to the gallery tomorrow. He always liked the Christmas show. Actually, they're in St. Lucia. Lugrado? Yeah. Please be sure to wish them both a Merry Christmas for me.
I'm not supposed to talk to you. My mom said the same thing. Let's meet. Uh, no. Hanging up now. Wait, wait. If our moms break up, they're gonna be on us even more. Plus, my mom just got divorced. I'm not gonna let her lose her best friend, too. Where? It's Christmas. It's time for the lights to start to shine in. It's time for the snow to start to fall in down to the sand. Impressive. And excessive. That's why he married me. How much is this gonna cost? Honey, we cannot skimp this year. I have to show Diana that I can win without her. I, I get it, but we have to cut back. After we the holidays, I promise, okay? And then after you land that London account, which you will. Is this fight really about Diana? Or is it something else? Something related to this? She has all but accused me of being pushy and controlling. I mean, maybe I am those things. But I thought she liked that about me. I mean, there's bumps in the road in every relationship. Just call her. No, no. Okay. Look, I'm just gonna cancel the trip. No, no, Paul. It'll be okay. And besides, it's only one Christmas. So we will do an early Christmas Eve dinner over video chat. That sounds awful. But we will make up for it on New Year's. Yeah? Yes. We promise. Why? Well, I... Uh, uh, uh. Oh, I just, I just want to put that right near the snowman. Look at that. More Christmas decorations. Don't worry. It was all on sale. 99 cents is my middle name. More like FedEx overnight. Hey, John. Hey, don't make fun of your wife's passions. You're one of them. Call Diana. Go to the airport. You're gonna miss your flight. Love you. Mm -hmm. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Are you sure this is a good idea? What if our moms catch us talking about them? Not gonna happen. Big public place, Friday night crowd. We'll blend right in. Besides, I feel like skating. I haven't been on the ice in a very long time. Oh, I'm excited. You want some help? Oh, no, I, I got it. Thanks. What, what time is it? Uh, 7.30. Why? But, uh, you know, people might just talk. Men and women hanging out after eight on a weekend is a date, as a rule. Mm. Well, we should wrap this up fast then. Rules are rules. I remember the last time you and I were both here, you were showing off for Kyle Simon and took out the entire no. senior class. Yeah, you did. Well, I wasn't showing off. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, fine. Maybe I was. <laughs> but I remember you were spinning around trying to impress Ashley K. Oh, please, no. I never liked Ashley K. You took her to prom in your powder blue tux. Wait, you remember my prom? And, and my wardrobe? Wait, I do live across the street, you know. Okay, so you're watching me. No. Got it. No, I mean, not exactly. I mean, it's, it's like an accident. You know, sometimes you just, you just can't look away. <laughs> okay. Gotcha. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> sir. So, what are we gonna do? About what? Our moms. Right, yeah. Isn't that why we're here? Yeah, um, let's just skate around for a while and I'm sure we'll think of something. As long as we're done by eight, right? Let's make it 7.59 just to be safe.
This will be the third Christmas in a row I have spent alone. Last year, I was in hot coffee, Mississippi. Mm. Before that, Love Ladies, New Jersey, and Scratch Angle, Alabama. Ooh. <laughs> to being alone at Christmas. So, um, I heard about you and Trish. Oh. Are the rumors really bad? Well, um, let's see. She gave you a black eye. Uh, you embezzled. Um, she cut the brakes on your car and something about arson. Oh. Wow, this time is ruthless. <laughs> For the record, I am Team Diana. Thank you. <laughs> it's funny, I feel like everybody wants to make this out to be a Christmas war, but honestly, it's just the end to a very long friendship. If you want to talk, I'm a good listener. It's hard because she's always been there for me. And I don't know if you heard, but my husband left last year and this is my first Christmas without him. I'm so sorry. Where have you been? You're not burying a body, are you? No. Come over here, I want to show you something. I had an epiphany. <laughs> a supermodel snow woman. Is that my swimsuit? You're donating it for the greater good, Sky. Listen, I have held this title for 10 years. I'm not letting someone else take it from me now. Oh, wait, wait, Sky, Sky. Maybe you can hang out here with me and we could do this together. It'll be fun. No, you're on your own. <laughs> so good. Hey, hi. Busted. Sleeping at 10.30 in the morning? <laughs> Cut me some slack. It's winter break. For me. For you, it's just another weekday. I think we should change our contact names, just in case one of our moms sees our phones. Oh, good idea. I'm going to make you two-pack. Like the rapper? No, like your abs. <laughs> <laughs> Were you calling for any particular reason? Yeah, about our moms. I got an idea. And for those of you with a gluten allergy, fear not, I love Oh, they're delicious. Morning. Hey there, Pooh Bear. Mom, you weren't gonna call me that anymore. Oh, I know, I know, I'm sorry, I forgot. Hey, do you think I'm a bad parent? What? Nothing. So, I was thinking about your gallery party tomorrow night, and I think you need another tree. We have a great tree. Oh, you wanna sell paintings, right? Ideally, yeah. So, trees create oxygen. More oxygen to the brain equals a better mood, equals greater likelihood of selling art. What's going on? N nothing, I just thought we'd enjoy hitting the Christmas tree lot. A little mother-son bonding time. You hate shopping. Yeah, but you don't. When was the last time we did anything together? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, so we'll go later. Yeah. So, so that's a yes? Yeah. Love to. I'm telling you, it's hard to find the right Christmas tree. Every yeah. year, I torture myself trying to find the right Christmas tree. It's well, not easy. I know, I know, I know. I like that one. It just needs one more tree for the foyer. 
Wait, 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 where are we going? Where yeah, is that I, one? I got a feeling about it over here. Hey, guys! Here. <laughs> Look at all of us chilling in the trees. Like the good old days, right? <laughs> I, I just, I just, I, I know. I feel terrible. Do you really? Really, I do. And I want you to know that I accept your apology. I'm, I'm sorry, you, you accept my apology? I do. Do you remember what you said to me? I remember what you said to me. Hey, remember those family forest trips we used to take? And Trisha's hot chocolates in mom's hand-painted Santa cups? Um, I remember Trisha's scalding chocolate. I remember her cups because I chipped a veneer. Hey, look, 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 a uh, blue spruce, your favorite tree, Trish. Oh, no, 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 Trish's favorite tree is a Douglas fir because it's big and fleshy. Well, I think bigger is better. Big like the bill from your nose job. Big like the boobs on your ex-husband's new wife. Oh, you. Oh, 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 no, no, my hand! No, 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 my hand! No, 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 on goat. Uh huh. And you are so not winning that golden reindeer this year. Who's gonna stop me? I am. You may be good at painting your little reindeer, but winning a golden one is out of your league, sweetie. Do you really think that you can win without me? Oh, I know I can. And I will. <laughs> This is a terrible place. That one will. Your mom is pretty extreme, huh? Yep. She gets that from my grandparents. No matter what she did, it was never enough. That's rough. It can be to another Christmas. <laughs> another Christmas. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. You're right, that is the best biked hot cocoa in town. <laughs> so, how's the job hunt? Uh, well, I'm still 22, still living in my childhood bedroom, so <laughs> how do you think it's going? Well, that's not, 22 is not exactly ancient. Yeah. I just, I want to do something that matters, you know? Like what? Uh, well, don't laugh. <laughs> There's this program where you can teach English in different countries all around the world. I'm not laughing. It's just, it's something I've always thought about. Living in a different place, doing something to help people. Well, where would you go? <laughs> well, I've narrowed it down to South America, Asia, Europe, and Africa. Mmm. Not Antarctica? <laughs> what? Oh, no, I just... I didn't know you'd be this easy to talk to. Cheers, then. <laughs> yeah, cheers. It's penguins. <laughs> Everything going okay? Yeah, it's good. Grab it. I'll be right back. Hi. Hi. Wow. Oh, thank you. You look really nice, too. Thanks. It's a nice turnout. Yeah, right? Yeah. Uh, how are the reindeer? 
Well, it looks like an avalanche blocked their migration room. Do you think they're going to be okay? Hope so. They're survivors, but there's not a lot of food in the mountain. Maybe they'll take another route. Maybe. It's not exactly in their nature, but we are hoping for a Christmas miracle. Yeah. I miss them. I know, I know, I know this sounds stupid, but they're my inspiration. It doesn't. <laughs> Don't repeat this to anyone, but my inspiration is a whistling Mormon. <sighs> I don't have any paintings of those. Well, I guess I'll just have to get this one. Now, I thought that you weren't a buyer. You said that, not me. Yeah. I can't think of a better Christmas present, but do you think you could hold on to it for me for a few days? Uh, no, no problem. Um, I can gift wrap it for you or box it up or, or whomever. It's for me. Oh. I, well. I better get going. Oh, yeah. I'll see you in a few yeah, days. Yeah, well, I'll be here. Okay. That's the second time he's been in the gallery. Uh, yeah, yeah, he, um, he likes the reindeer. Oh, yeah, <laughs> and you. Oh, he's just a nice guy. He's leaving a painting so that he can come back later. He's asking you out. He's, he is not asking me out. And even if he was, I wouldn't go. Why not? Because I... I'm your mom. Aren't you supposed to be just disgusted at the thought of me dating? Oh, I'm totally grossed out. Well, but I also want you to be happy. Well, you really want me to be happy. Help me take that golden reindeer away from Trish. No, I'm not doing that. She's stealing my customers. This is getting completely out of hand. You know what? I don't want you to worry about it. It's fine. I got it. Your mom you lived in my mom. Body, but no, 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 I'm a single mom. I can do it by myself. I don't need you to do anything. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Stop. I'll help. Okay, thank you, Pooh Bear. Mom. <laughs> Everything looks amazing. Oh, you came! Oh, hey, listen. I wanted to invite you to Christmas dinner with Jake and me. Diana, you don't have to do that. No, I know. We'd really love to have you there. And I just, I don't think anybody should be alone at Christmas. It won't be extravagant, but I do make a mean vegan turkey. I'd love to. Thank you. Oh, good. Okay. Because we'd love to have you. Thank you. Hey, hey, don't look over there. Mm. Trish will just say that I'm copying. I'm not looking over there. She's already got the judges wrapped around her finger. Okay, she's really... Manipulative. I know. I know what she is. Didn't she just donate all that stuff to the hospital? Yeah, and you know who's on the board of the hospital? The wife of one of the judges. I'm not sure that's why. Okay, fine, yes, she's she's generous, okay? Everybody has one good quality. This is the section I'm gonna call Elves Gone Wild. Excuse me, what could be more important than what's going on here? Let's see, everything. Who's that? N nobody. Wow. What? Proud of yourself? Yep. Oh. Uh -huh. What's that? Go big or go home. <laughs> we are home. <laughs> Bring the elves to the porch! <laughs> I don't remember it ever being this crazy at Christmas before. Maybe you just didn't notice because you always had a boyfriend during the holidays. 
Have you ever been in love? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. Hmm. You? Mm, I don't think so. Really? I mean, <laughs> I've been in relationships, but... I think they were just a way for me to feel... not alone. Is being alone so bad? Sometimes. Because when I'm alone, I have to think about who I really am. And how everyone thinks I'm perfect. Well, if it's any consolation, I never thought you were perfect. You didn't? You're a little too color-coordinated. You blink weird. You like stamps funny. Have you ever noticed that? Oh. <laughs> Should I go on? No, I'm, I'm good. Didn't realize you noticed so much about me. If it makes you feel better, you can say some bad stuff about me. Hmm, okay. Well, uh... Right now, I... I can't actually think of anything. Let's give it time. Hmm. <laughs> It is? Mm -hmm. And it's a Saturday night, so officially we, we may have left the friend zone. <laughs> <laughs> so what do we do now? Rules are rules. Okay, no, our moms will kill us if they Please find do out. Not bring up our moms <laughs> right now. Did you get the pictures? Yes, I got them, but they're not enough. I need more. More? Yes, more anger, more fighting, more carnage. It's just... Uh, it's just what? She invited me over for Christmas. Oh, that's perfect. What? Oh, you know how people are during the holidays. Like, you know, tempers flare, nerves are frayed of jingle all the way. But she's a divorced mom. She's going through a hard time. It, it feels wrong to keep crying. So work on the other housewife. What happened with 99 cents being your middle name? Okay, so I had to add a few more nines. We can barely afford our house payments. We will work it out. We always do. Will you please call Diana? No. Besides, she's already replaced me. Now, come on. Who could replace you? Apparently, it's not that difficult. Well, I disagree. I miss you. Miss you, too. Love you. Love you, too. Thought maybe you could use a little frap action? Wouldn't that be consorting with the enemy? I'm just an outsider. Although, if I was a gambler, I would be leaning towards Team Trish. <gasps> it's beautiful. 
Thank you. A lot of memories in here. And trophies. <laughs> well, in 48 hours, I'll have another one. It must be strange competing against your best friend. X. You know, she doesn't even care about winning. She's only in this to take me down. I've heard some of the tales. You guys were legends. We were. I actually remember the day that it started. They had just moved into the neighborhood and there was this mom at school, Bree Flanagan, Miss Perfect. You know, she was the head of the PTA, threw the best parties, gourmet snacks at soccer games, you know. And every year she won Best Holiday House. And every year I tried to take her down. But Diana, she just walked over here one day and offered to help. You know, for her, it's, it's an art. It's not a competition. And that Christmas, she was here every single day. And we won. Or I won. And after that, we were a team. You really miss her. Yeah, well, I'll get over it. This is the one place my mom won't look for me. Pretty sure no place is safe from Trish. Huh. We're like the Montagues and the Capulets. Didn't Romeo and Juliet end up dead? <laughs> we just stopped talking. Here. Yeah, we should. <laughs> it's Christmas, you know. It's everywhere you go. The twink. I'm terrible at this. No. You're not. I don't even know what we're painting, but I'll take a guess that it's a reindeer. Uh. Whistling Marmot. You know, um, seeing as I don't know how much longer I'm going to be here, mm -hmm. and being that this is the most amount of human contact I've had in a while, <laughs> can I take you out to dinner? I, I, um, I'm sorry. I, that is so sweet. What? I, um, I don't think I'm ready yet to have dinner with a person, I mean, a, a man, besides my son. I'm, we, did I tell you that I have a, a kid? I mean, I, well, he's not a kid, he's a grown up, but he's back at home, which is nice to have him there. Not that I, you know, need to have a guy in my house or I'm like, who am I? It's, Pretty recent divorce. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, we've been separated for a year, but we just finalized our divorce. Mine's been five years. It gets easier. Well, pencil me in five years from now. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Well, I am here for the reindeer, so I better get back to it. Yeah. It's, it's you did good. <laughs> did well. <laughs> oh, um, right. <laughs> nice to see you again, Ben. It's really nice to see you, Nick. You still have your dolls. They're not dolls. They're actually limited edition action figures, and they're only there because I'm selling them online. I find that hard to believe. OK, maybe I'm not selling them, but I could. They are collector's items. Mm -hmm. You still have your My Little Pony? Absolutely not. Spice Girls? Nope. Jonas Brothers autographed poster? OK. Maybe, but it's in a box, at least. That makes it better. Pooh Bear, are you home? I forgot my phone charger. Pooh Bear? <laughs> Sweetie? Yeah, yeah, just taking a nap. Hey, do you have any laundry? I figured I may as well do a load while I'm here. Uh, no, we're good. I'm good. Really? 
Even those dirty socks and underwear festering in the corner? No, no, I'll just burn those. <laughs> okay. Do downward donner, plank prancer, reclining mood up. I, I feel like I'm missing something. Sky, help me. Where do you want this elf? No, no, no. That that, that goes in elves gone wild section. Oh, oh, you should have said that earlier. I, I, it's something over uh, here is missing. What is it? Jake. Oh, honey, I realized what it was I needed to do. Look at this. I call it long may they reign, dear. It's good, right? I could live with that. Fred, Fred, there are no more wire reindeer on aisle 10. Yeah, I just sold the last one to Mrs. Logan like two minutes ago. Looking great. Oh, thank you so much. Um, it's just that uh, I, I really need that reindeer. Oh, I'm sorry. This is for my granddaughter. I, I'm sure you could find her something else. Oh, no, I can't. This is what she wants. <laughs> She's seven. She'll get over it. She's making a diorama. I'll give you 50 bucks. No. It's a $30 profit. It's not for sale. How about 100 No, I, I told you it's not for sale. 200 no! It's my reindeer! That's a slogan! Where is your holiday spirit? up in the holiday spirit, dear. On the other hand, I hope Diana takes you down. I need a Blitzen! No, you need a tranquilizer. We are running out of time. Okay, chop chop. Look at this. Is that my stag? What? <sighs> Hold this. Do not come one step further. Give me the hammer. That's my stag. You gave it to me! Nope, I lent it to you. You never brought it back. Fine. I want to make something very clear to you. Sky does not love you more than she loves me. What are you talking about? Diana said that? And worse. Mom, that's crazy. You know I love you. More than her? How can you ask me that? Because we never talk anymore. Because it's always so intense. Like, I don't want to be thinking about the future all the time. But you're always pushing it and pushing it. Look, and I know you can't help it, but it's too much. Ugh, honey. 
Yeah? Could, could I have that, that the hamper? Sorry. I just, I just, I just need the hamper. Thank you. What's in Thanks for meeting me. What are you doing? I need a Blitzen. I need it for the judging tonight. Blitzen? Sky, aren't you a little worried that you're turning into your mother? What's wrong with that? Well, for one thing, she's completely out of control. What about your mom? Hmm? You love my mom. Not more than mine. Wait, what? <sighs> Did I miss something? Look, this thing with us, it it isn't going to work. Wow. You're ending this because of them. It started because of them. Not for me. Jake. You're really bailing because of our moms or because you're scared you might be feeling something? Well, it's just, um, the last thing I need right now is another relationship. Well, we hated each other before. No reason we can't go back to that. Can we still be friends? I don't know. Maybe we never were. person. All right, Tank, it's time for the competition. Come along. There are many more houses to judge. Looks like a tranquil town full of holiday cheer, but scratch the surface, and you'll find a nest full of Christmas vipers. Sandra, what, what are you doing here? Didn't you get my message? Yes, I got it. Okay, pan over there. Get that stuff. I am quitting. Listen, you work for American Life, which means I own the story, and it's gonna be big. You should watch. We start streaming Christmas Eve. You can't do this. Watch me. Okay, pan over there. Get some white shots. We're coming up to Diana's house. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi. Oh, Kendall, you brought a whole crew. That is so no, it's fantastic. Diana. Listen, everything you see here on my lawn is biodegradable. Nothing you see will hurt the environment. You know. <laughs> There's no need to film second place over there. Come on. Come on over here. Hi. 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 Good to see you. I have Rice Krispie Reese, fresh gingerbread cookies, and white hot chocolate to wash it all down. Why? Because, because there's, there's always room for dessert. <laughs> well, what's the big deal if she wins? She won't. She went low, I went lower. Mrs. Rivera, cheetah at Christmas charades! <laughs> Mom! Did you just step you to me? You kidding me? No. Troop 9? No! You may as well have called and trained assassins! You bribed the judges! You yellowed my snow! Oh, come on! That was Mrs. Logan's dog! Because I couldn't sleep! She just got pegged by Santa! 
watching an all-out Christmas war where two backstabbing former friends try to destroy each other. Turn it off! Right before the... Turn it off! Kendall, get out of the way! No! Oh, my God. What do you mean, no? This is a hatchet job. She played us. What kind of story is this, Kendall? I'm so sorry. It, it wasn't supposed to be like this, not at first. I invited you into my home. I invited you over for Christmas dinner. Christmas dinner? That's our thing. Oh, everyone, American Life Online, The Real Housewives of the North Pole. Uh, tune in, we start streaming on Christmas Eve. You are not American Life. You're a low life. A sleazeball, immoral, pathetic Scrooge bag. Oh, no, don't break that. I'll sue you. I mean, you would also have to break cameras B and C as well. Fine. I quit. You already quit. You, you ruined Christmas. You ruined everything. Well, I guess you don't have to worry about that anymore. Because I am done with this place. I'm selling our house. And I forfeit. Looks like we have a new winner. The Golden Reindeer Award goes to Diana Forrester. No, 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 no. I, 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 I forfeit too. I forfeit too. Please tell me you got that. How's London, Dad? Very English. Hey, guess what? I got the account. Oh, I knew you would. Yeah, congratulations, Dad. That's great. Thanks. Thanks, hon. We miss you. I miss you, too. If you guys don't mind, I'm gonna go to my room. But it's Christmas Eve. It doesn't really feel like it. Merry Christmas, Dad. Merry Christmas, baby. I'll be right back. Sky, wait. Um, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm always on your case. I just, I just want what's best for you. I know. But I'm not you, Mom. I don't want what you want. I want something else. Everything. Turn down the account. What? I don't care about moving. I don't care about this house anymore or that stupid competition, which I forfeited, by the way. I've been spending all this time creating this 
perfect image so that nobody would see what a mess I am. Well, I don't care what anyone thinks anymore. I only care about you and Sky. The next time I'm going on the trip with you, I feel like a change of scenery will do us good. Now there's a Trish I fell in love with. I love you, honey. I love you too. I'm gonna give you a Christmas present right now. I thought we were doing handmade gifts. We are. I signed it. Mom, this is too much. No, 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 no. I had a great season. I don't want you to worry about me because I'm gonna be just Fine, and I want you to take that money. I want you to go somewhere you want to go. Do something that you want to do, okay? You're gonna figure it out. I did. Thank you. I love you. You're welcome, sweetie. Are you gonna... Train assassins! You bribed the judges! You yellow eyes snow! Oh, come on! That was Mrs. Logan's dog! Because I couldn't wait! She just got paid! My Santa! Thank you, Santa! Yoma Bye! Troop 9? No! Oh, come on! That was Mrs. Logan's dog! Because I couldn't wait! She just got paid! And why are you dressed like that? All my clothes are in the laundry. And I wanted to talk to you tonight. Are you legit crazy? Maybe. <sighs> but maybe I'm also jobless and living at home. But I'm also hopelessly in love with you. Jake. I'm sorry about what I said before. I'm sorry, too. You were right. I was scared. Still am. Me too. But I think I'm more scared of losing you. Oh. And and also falling. Yeah, I don't want this to end like Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> <laughs> 
So what do we do? Get in here. I was hoping you'd say that. Okay. Are you okay? Yeah, I got it. I got Someone made the naughty list. How long has this been going on? Um, well, there's 12 days of Christmas. You've been lying to us this entire time? Lying, ice skating, drinking your wine. We're in a relationship, <laughs> I think. So, <laughs> yeah. the both of you are just gonna have to get used to it. And while we're on the subject of getting used to things. I'm not going to grad school next year. I'm taking a gap year. And I'm gonna take a year, no gap. Yep, we're gonna teach English to kids in Africa. Or South America, we haven't really Really, decided. I don't, I guess we haven't really talked about this. We will. <laughs> okay, well, let us know. I think this is, this is, I think that, that Sounds amazing. <laughs> really? Thought you might be upset. <laughs> All we have ever wanted is for the two of you to get together. But we could be in-laws. We, we could be co grandparents Yeah. Oh, okay. no, 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 I'm so sorry, Trish. I I behaved like a crazy person. And I'm so sorry that I threw the frap in your face. It was kind of refreshing. You no, know, it was nice. I only said those terrible things because I'm jealous of how you and Skye are together. Because she's not mine. I mean, ask Jake. It is not easy being my son. Don't have to. You were right. I have been leaning on him way too much this year, and then I took it out on you. Hey, what are friends for? <laughs> Merry Christmas. Oh, Kendall, you are wasting your time here. There is nothing here to shoot. Nope. I, I'm, I'm not here for that. Um, actually, I quit. But I do have something for both of you. Oh, thank you, Kendall. The thing is, I lost sight of why I became a writer in the first place. To bring a little happiness to people. I'm so sorry for everything. But you'll be happy to know that people were too busy celebrating Christmas to watch the piece of trash website. Yeah, oh, I watched I it. The everything, home. every frame. I'm so embarrassed how he acted. Okay, well, I guess I better get going. You can't just leave. What? <laughs> it's Christmas. Yeah, I mean... And the spirit of Christmas is all about... Forgiveness. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I miss you. I miss you too. <laughs> Why don't I have my camera now? Oh, I'm so sorry. Um... Mom? Look who it is. Eat 
brought the reindeer back. Okay, that's not a sign. I don't know what it is. Okay, all right. You found them. Well, they found us. Listen, everything I said before, I was just scared. I haven't been single in a really long time. Everything is different. And I, I wouldn't even know what to say on a first date. And if you don't know what to say, you start with Merry Christmas. If I can do that. And then maybe we can try Happy New Year. Will you still be here New Year's? Well, I thought that once I found the reindeer, I'd want to leave, but uh, I don't. That is great, because Groundhog Day around here is pretty epic. <laughs> you don't say. <laughs> Duty calls. Yeah. See ya. Yeah. Did you see that? What? That reindeer had a red nose. <laughs> oh, shut up and no, I'm kiss not... me. <laughs> no, I'm not kidding, though. No. <laughs> After the photo, you know I do. Do I do Get in your okay. position. Oh, no. oh right. the tree. <laughs> Are you sure you want to be in this? Maybe next year's. Yeah, maybe next year. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. Okay. Get together. Say cheese. We have a different tradition. Ready? Pumpkin, Pumpkin cheesecake! cheesecake!